mighty long, and at some landing she's wide. Folks down south say she's another river's bride. But I know she is married. Sly lives when she's being waiting for somebody in the bus. And then there's Chuckleberry. Hi, Chuck. Hi, handsome Chuckleberry. Who's daddy's boy? So that's Chuck. So it's, it's nine o'clock at night, and our camper tries to set itself on fire when we try and set the furnace on. So, how does that make you feel about our first day on the journey? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> we got the kids all buckled up in here. We got the, them plugged in watching a movie. Sorry, kind of hard to see because the windows are super, super tinted. But there's Lily with her her headphones on watching a movie. So this is this is what we're doing now. We're gonna drive until we pass the heck out. <laughs> I tell you, this is the life right here. We got the wife and the kids are all outside with the dogs playing out here at the, the lake. I'm in here frying up some eggs, getting ready to make some breakfast for everybody. <sighs> Just relaxing. I mean, we're running on like, I don't know, four hours of sleep, three or four hours of sleep, but it doesn't seem to matter when you're, uh, when you can hear the kids playing in the background. I don't know beautiful life you know it is what you make it and we fought so long to to figure out our place or whatever and I think uh, I think we might be in our little piece of heaven if now only we can figure out how to afford this life <laughs> that's a whole nother thing we're at uh, I believe it's pronounced Piranagat uh, Wildlife Refuge and Ellie what'd you find I found a cactus. She found her first cactus. <laughs> Look at that rotten old thing. Touch it. No. Why not? Because it's a cactus. Well, I actually touched a cactus and it really hurts. Oh, so you probably shouldn't touch cactus? They're probably. All right. But you can't buy them to eat. And they're tasty, right? Uh-huh. Heck yeah, they are. Buy them. Go and buy them right now. Well, this is the Paranagat Wildlife Refuge, lower, the lower lake. Sorry about the lens flare there. I don't have any filter on this thing. Uh, I'm probably getting some wind noise here too, so I apologize for that. I'll try and edit as much of it out in post as I can. So, anyway, this is uh, Paranagat. <laughs> what did you just find, Lily? A cactus. Where's it at? Show it to me. Walk me over there. <laughs> what? You found your own cactus. So we're driving through Vegas and our darn thing falls off. Fun. So we're putting everything inside the camper now. And when he says we. I mean her, I'm videotaping, I'm busy. We uh, saw a little turn off for a national park, so we figured we'd stop and take a peek around. It's absolutely beautiful out here. Oh, she got her flip flops on. She's ready to go flip flopping. Anyway, she's ready to step in the water. Go to school of rock. I want He's to ready to play basketball. Oh. So I want to go and walk. He's got tashes. Ducks are just chilling, man. They don't even care. Well, 
other than the garbage, this is a really pretty spot out here towards the Hoover Dam. Um, I don't really know exactly where we're at. Somewhere near the Hoover Dam. You can see Lake Mead over there in the distance. Yep, that's where the water runs down through the canyon here when it rains. You go. Oh no, Ellie's gone forever. Ah! Wow. Pretty cool. This is super cool, huh? This is a pretty cool, cool spot. Be all right. As long as there's anybody else with a dog. <laughs> You gonna touch it, Lily? I don't know. Touch the rock? I want my coat. We'll go back here. Yeah, Liz is in the lead, showing us where to go through this wonderful, awesome canyon. Whoa. Really cool little spot. Unfortunately, like everything in Nevada, it's Whoa. full of trash. Whoa! Yeah. Bats. <laughs> Are you for breezing? I'm shivering. What happened to our Alaska girl? It's like 50 degrees out here. Okay. We're now in the water trench. It's hollow it sounds when you're walking. Grass is always greener on the other side. It's already spring, right? Uh, it's January 4th. It is not spring. Not January 3rd. January 3rd. It is not spring. Whatever day it is. Probably where a rattlesnake lives. to the highway. I don't know what highway, but another road anyway. Really cool. I am right by you. Right, right next to you. Yep, I think we're at the end of this little valley. Perfect place for a bag of play sand. Yep, we're at the end of it. The, there's a fence right there. So that's pretty much as far as we can go. But it's still pretty cool. Charlie, can get up there? Yeah, let's not get that close to the road, though. Today we're at the Hoover Dam, finally made it here. Um, we had to park about 25 miles from the Hoover Dam, so we gotta walk, but uh, anyway, so there'll be a lot of this video. A lot of that. Oh, Hoover Dam. How cool is that? This is the toilet of America. Water goes around and flushes down there instead of flooding out the dam. 
how to so, the Hoover camera Dam heater not work at 12 so below. For those who've never been to the Hoover Dam, Adam, we lost the um, oh, was that, the trailer hitch yeah. extension thingy in Las Vegas, and uh, so far today has been fairly uneventful. Not Wood. But anyway, so that's our trip on this episode. So thank you so much for joining us while we went to the Hoover Dam, went through Las Vegas, and, and uh, explored the Granigan, uh Wildlife Refuge. Uh, Till next episode, thank you guys very much. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment down below with somewhere. If you guys have anywhere you want to see that we haven't been, comment down below with where it's at, and we'll do our best to make sure that we try and get there. So until next time, we love you guys. Take care. Thank <laughs> you.